being unique in a creative space is kind of an understatement where being unique is kind of the new normal now and it forces everyone to constantly change especially in this day and age where creativity is almost everything is is constantly changing constantly having to be unique and be creative I am Ernest Alexander Novarte but I like to go by Ian Sane I got started in photography when I was about 12 years old when my dad bought a camera and we would always just go to like family events and parties, go on trips and take pictures and he would show me a bunch of sceneries. I started photography as a way to kind of capture moments that are really special to me and not, well not only to me but to others as well. Photography to me means something that is unique to just me because um, I come from a family of of artists and they like they like a specific type of art and I feel like photography is my way of showing my my art. It helps me capture the beauty within a bad world as we would call it or whenever you're troubled you see you see a smile. I like to reminisce and with my photographic memory it helps me kind of remember all the good times and happy moments that were there before the picture. I usually enjoy just the nice fresh air just being out instead of being cooped up in the house. Rather than like sitting on my computer all day I would rather be out taking pictures just getting to see the world as, as it is and as we know it. Being pressured to be creative like towards my photography is me constantly changing. I'd say the most difficult part is finding out what to do next and trying to find my next step forward. Sometimes I'll do the same thing twice, other times I'll change it up. I won't take a picture of the same person or I won't do the same scene over and over. You don't wear the same thing every day. You don't eat the same thing every day. It's, it's having to change a routine. What have you done compared to what are you going to do? So if what you've done was already take a picture of this one flower, the next thing you're going to do is take a picture of a tree or maybe where the flower came from. Maybe it's a field, a field of flowers. It's mainly more about expanding your interests and broadcasting it to others. What inspires me to continue to shoot is mainly me wanting to show people that I'm, I'm not just some regular guy that you would see on the street. I actually have a vision and if my vision doesn't meet your standards then I guess it's to each their own at that point. <laughs>